All right, quick show of hands. Who's ready for Operation Football? Definitely me. I'm certainly <laughs> ready. Our Chuck Lofton, we know he is ready. He was with the students at Zionsville High School this morning as we get ready. Who is for... that guy? Oh, <laughs> someone got there a little bit late, didn't have time to do his hair yet. <laughs> well, we know that's not the case for Chuck. We'll check in with him and Nicole. <laughs> Well, welcome back to Sunrise, our time 545. It's hard to believe that it is already time for Operation Football. Yeah, we're so <laughs> excited about kicking off another great season of Operation Football for you. Chuck Lofton's where the party is at this morning. He is in Zionsville. Good morning, Chuck. Good morning, everybody. Let's do it again. We are live in Zionsville. You can go ahead and play with the marching band here this morning. And if there was ever a doubt that Zionsville would not turn out for the first Operation Football, hey, no doubt at all. We've got a bunch of people here as we celebrate the 2016 season of Operation Football. And we start right here. Tonight we have literally a plethora of games, including the big one at Center Grove for Zionsville. They take on Pike High School tonight. This is a big deal in Zionsville because they actually won't begin here. All of these fans are going to travel to Pike Township to uh, root their eagles on against the uh, Pike Township Red Devils. These are three of our great student council members here at Zionsville. Cassidy, Marissa, and Claire. And Claire, let me start with you. Zionsville, this is a great opportunity for you guys to be the first school of the year on Operation Football. Thank you so much, Chuck. We are so excited to be here and can't wait for an amazing season with our Eagles. All right. And Marissa, now tell us a little bit about Zionsville because we're talking about football primarily, but you guys are proud of so many things here at the school. There's so many things to be proud of when you're an Eagle, but most importantly, the school spirit we have and how each student really supports one another just really makes us proud to be an Eagle. And Marissa, you're a senior right? Yeah, you're Cassidy. Yep. Tell me a little bit about uh, what the senior year looks like for you. Um, senior year can be a little stressful, but the teachers are always here to help us, and our school supports each other, so I'm very excited for a great senior year with my friends. All right, well, we're excited, too. Hey, we love these Zionsville Community High School Eagles. We're going to be live here throughout the morning. You're going to get to meet some of the players, the band, and we'll tell you why football is king in Indiana. We are live, live from Zionsville High School. Scott and Julia, back to you. All right. Right. Well, what a great turnout yeah. for Art to kick off Sunrise Operation yes. Football yep. there in Zionsville. And the Friday night lights are back on for high school football season. We're live this morning at Zionsville High kicking off Operation Football. Well, we're excited this morning because high school football season is back. And our Chuck Lofton in Zionsville at the high school there this morning. Good morning, Chuck. Good morning. We are live in Zionsville Operation Football today with the Zionsville High School Eagles. We're back with more from Zionsville as sunrise continues. Right now, though, he's toasting uh, several dozen right. high school students <laughs> in Zionsville for Operation Football. Good morning to you, Chuck. And a banana. <laughs> Good morning, Julia. We just got out of Uber, and we're ready to go today for Operation Football. All right. We are live in Zionsville. And, you know, we have selected Zionsville to be the first school to participate in Operation Football this year. Last year in 2015, we had an incredible group of showing from high schools. We're doing it again this year. We're glad to have the Zionsville High School Marching Band with us. And we're looking for the principal, Tim East. Where's the principal? There he is. <laughs> Come on on. We're live, Tim. Wow, what an exciting day for you guys. This oh, it is just so awesome to highlight Zionsville High School and all the neat things our kids are doing. We're off to a great start this year. Last year, five and seven in football, but you won the section. Oh, you know, Coach did a great job preparing our team for the postseason, and they came out ready to play and made a great run in the state tournament. Now, you guys are going to have your first game against Pike tonight away. Next week, it's Eagle. Fest, right? Oh, yeah. Next uh, Friday night, starting at 5 o'clock, right here across from the field, Eagle Fest. It's a great community night. Uh, thousands will be out to 
support the Eagles and all of our fall sports. And it's a chance for you to not only highlight the athletic part of uh, Zinesville with this magnificent stadium, it's only six years old, but also your academics. Absolutely. We're so thankful for the support of our community. This year we've uh, started a new uh, extended experiences coordinator, connecting our kids with the community beyond the classroom. We're really excited. Well, Tim, thanks for having us this morning. Coming up in just a few minutes, we're going to meet some of the players, the, the great head coach of the Zionsville Eagles, and we're also going to have a few surprises from our Zionsville marching band. Again, Operation Football, we're starting it off here tonight. Uh, all the games, Jason and uh, Rich and I will be covering it in just a few minutes. Jason Spells will have our battle plan. We'll also be back live. Folks, thank you. We love Zionsville. We're going to be back here in just a few minutes, live from Zionsville High School. Julian Scott, we've had a great turnout this morning. I know. I, I'm always amazed how many kids get up so early to be on sunrise uh, during Operation yeah. Football because we'll be back out there next Friday as well. And the leaping bananas. The leaping bananas. All right. Thanks so much, Chuck. Yeah, Eagle Pride on display this morning. Yeah. Well, high school football, it's back. That's right. This morning we are kicking off Operation Football. We've got the kids up early with Chuck Lofton in Zionsville. Good morning, Chuck. Hey, good morning and welcome from Sam, Sam and Teresa, our drum majors, to Zionsville High School. We are at the first Operation Football live remote of 2016. You know, we began this in 2015 with a number of high schools. Everybody turned out well. No surprise that we have hundreds of students here from Zionsville for today's beginning of Operation Football. Jason Spells in minutes is going to have uh, the battle plan for all the games that we're going to be covering tonight. Coach Pat Edgevera is here. Pat, five and seven last year, but what a way to end the season with a sectional championship. Yeah, it was a great springboard for us coming into the offseason, and our players are really bought in, and I couldn't be excited for the season, more excited for the season to start. Big game tonight against Pike, right? Uh, yeah, you know, it's a cr uh, really close rivalry for us. Uh, first time playing Pike in the regular season, and uh, I know these guys will be ready to roll. All right. Well, they play Pike next week, and then go play Pike this week. Next week, have Eagle Fest. Yeah, we got Lebanon, a county rival, so, you know, the season starts off right with our first two games, no question. Well, we got some of our players here. Drew is a senior this year. What are you looking forward to for the Eagles? Well, we've all worked so hard this summer. Uh, I just can't wait to get out under the lights and compete. And I'm ready, and I'm ready to play. All right, well, guys, congratulations on being the first team in the state this year on Operation Football. Coach, yeah. How about these fans? Great. Coming out this early, uh, we got a great community here, and I uh, appreciate everybody coming out this morning. God bless. Congratulations, Coach. Hey, we just want to thank everybody from Zionsville. We have tons of parents in the stands. We've had the Zionsville marching band turnout, and what a wonderful start to Operation Football. Remember, coming up in just a few minutes, Jason Spells is going to have the battle plan. We're, we're live in Zionsville. Julian Scott, it's been a great morning. Operation Football begins today. Back to you. A lot of great school spirit there in Zionsville. Go Eagles. Nice going, Chuck. And I wanted to ask him if that football player has especially soft, Drew, tender yeah, skin. Yeah, Drew. Drew's got kid. the great hair at <laughs> Zionsville. Must. Nice going. We will leave you this morning with a shot of Operation Football <laughs> kicks off. Don't you forget, it starts on sunrise. We'll be going all night through here tonight at Channel 13 as well. Great turnout from the kids there in Zionsville. Have